evening. I'm Joe Tessitore alongside Teddy Atlas, and we welcome you to the Thomas and Mack Center just off the Vegas Strip for tonight's main event. Ten rounds of heavyweights. Boy, and we expect this to be a big night of action. We spoke with both fighters yesterday. Fireworks anticipated here tonight. Let's see. Kid Dynamite's making his way to the ring right now, and he does so with an attitude that belies his in-ring intensity. Butcher's showing you that intensity that so many of the very best will display during a ring walk. Totally focused. that uppercut. now to the left hand good straight shot good block by butcher reaching the halfway mark of this round nice nice how about that left hand Look at this, another power punch able to land. We're early on in this fight, he's going for it. Yeah, you wonder if he's got a call waiting outside. The left hand coming into play by Butcher. Seconds remaining in this round. Kid Dynamite's effort in that last round really didn't do much for him. I just don't think he was busy enough. No, he wasn't busy enough. And you start to wonder whether or not he wants to be here. It has to change quickly now because if it doesn't, his opponent is going to kind of smell it a little bit. And he's going to start pushing a little bit more and put him in bad problems. Good right hand by Butcher. Butcher's hit to the head. On the mark with a straight left hand. A little head hunting with the right. Well landed that hook by Kid Dynamite. Jab, uppercut, both upstairs. A sharp hook to the head by Kid Dynamite. Teddy, he did a smart thing right there. Just created enough space and then landed the counter punch. Looked like the will of the wisps, the old great Willie Peck. Made him miss, made him pay. Butcher's defense. Is it ever good? Look at how easy he's able to block those punches. 
halfway through round number two. Goes up top with a right hand. Wow, is he defensively sound. Teddy, early on here, you cannot stress enough how much good comes from going to the body. And you can't stress how many times you heard your parents tell you as a kid, put that change into the piggy bank because it's going to add up. Well, body punches add up. Butchers the target of a hook. Ten seconds to go in this round. And we come to the end of round number two. Kid Dynamite's really impressing us here tonight. That last round, boy, he was on top of his game and all over his opponent. Played out some serious damage there. Yeah, I noticed that he's starting to land that uppercut a little bit. The only thing that I wouldn't be satisfied with what he did the last round, I would just look for for confidence to do more as sort of a good roadmap to maybe even get a knockout victory here. Put something on top of those uppercuts. You know the uppercut's landing. Now put something up top. Good return fire that time. Back to the body. Blocks the headshot. Good solid right hand by Butcher. Tried to land that upstairs and was off the mark. Lands flush with the two-punch combo by Kid Dynamite. Kid Dynamite's defense is paying off now. And coming upon the halfway mark of this three-minute round. Tucks those elbows in, blocks the body shot. Hit Dynamite's movements really helping him out, avoiding that punch. Wow! He gets floored with one single shot. He was just torn down like an old building. This fight is over. Kid Dynamite's the man. One single punch, one solid knockout. That's all it took. And I love the way he did it. He tricked him into it. He made him walk in a little bit and then bang. Good, enjoyable, entertaining fight it was. For Teddy Atlas, I'm Joe Tessitore saying thanks for being with us.